Hello and greetings, my fellow Londarkins. Welcome back, Londark Custom Interloper. Your daily dose of TLD. And I think actually at the end of the day, we will have rifle naming day. I think it'll be close enough. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, about. Day 189, Yeah, about day 200 almost. That's a little bit of a shorter episode, but I want to make sure we have a little bit of a longer one for the rifle naming. And I didn't want to have that in the wrong spot. So my main concern today is actually getting all this moose meat cooked before the update. And then we're going to head out where the update's going to be. So I will try to get there this week. Uh, the update's actually slated for next week now. A couple little bugs pushed it back, which I'm kind of glad. It wasn't anything big, but it was a couple little texture issues, some ground stuff. I'm actually probably going to go in there and maybe see about some coal. Do we have the lantern? Do we put that? Um, just in case. I don't think that'll be dark, but just in case. Yeah, let's go do that. I would rather have coal. That would make that easier. Right, right on a good note, I get to, I get to putz around in the uh, test build a little bit longer. So that's kind of nice. Uh, I will have a review of the update probably the day it comes out. Uh, as I said, I probably got about 60 hours. I'll probably have probably about 100 hours by the time it comes out. Uh, so I should have the map pretty darn good. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm just going to go out. Is the rifle? Okay, just just in case. I'm not going to go shoot a bear, though. I don't I don't need that kind of hassle right now. We've got too much going on. Ooh, cold one today, too. Gonna go check the cave and see about. Oh, also want to get. Got some charcoal if we need. I don't want to get this area mapped out. So we're actually looking nice and quiet out here. At 19. Not quite what I meant, but. Uh, I guess we'll use it eventually. Oh, that wind, though. No really need to jog. I can save your energy. How late in the day did we... Nah, not too late. Not too late. Can't feel my hands. Hopefully that update gets earlier in the week. Um, I kind of always like it on Fridays, but if it does happen early, early in the week, uh, probably no marathon. I just really busy schedule between YouTube and Twitch. I don't think I could do a Twitch marathon during the week. Let's see about the weekend. I do do Dungeon and Dragons on a live stream on Saturday nights now, so that's also a thing. It's just a little dark in here. I kind of want to save that lantern a bit. I just wanted to go do some fishing out of Mystery Lake real quick. But when's the last time we grabbed the coal out of here? I think it's been a while. Actually, if I remember right, I don't think there is actually a ton of coal in here, is there? No, I don't think there is. Oh, take that back. All right. Well, I went through halfway through the cave, and I did not see any coal, so I was beginning to wonder. Yep, and you're still dead. Mark, very disrespectful of the dead, I feel. Just leaves him like that. Just bury him in the snow outside, maybe. That would make, kind of make this a very dark game, though, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, like I thought, not a lot of coal, but a little bit. Enough to make it worth the trip, I guess. Just a perfectly campfire, ready to be uh, lit. Uh, I do want to turn around to, and I'm using a lot of lantern fuel. I'd rather not. we good enough? I feel like I'm good enough. 
And if I turn this off, can I... Yeah, oh yeah. Well, actually, we probably can be. Alright, then. Sometimes these caves, you never know. Let's see, maybe if I do, I just brighten this up in editing. Of course, YouTube sometimes darkens the videos as well, so it's never a uh, guarantee. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my way back. I feel like I've gotten the bare share of that. I've gotten the bear share. I feel good about that. I might have to drop some gear. So we got that way. Oh yeah, thirty. You're a kilogram over. That's me being nice to you, man. Seriously. I kind of would like that they added a bear in a cave sometime. I know that's like severely dangerous, but come on, that would be great. Running along all of a sudden. Bear? I'd rather have the bear than the... I don't know. The moose, I feel like that'd be less deadly somehow. But a bear in here would be just... Oh, that'd be great. Okay, we're just gonna leave him. That's fine. I'm not gonna worry about it. I mean, he's not going anywhere. Too bad he can't at least, you know, cut up his clothes for some cloth or something. So I'm not sure if I was going the right way. I think we are. I probably didn't need that lantern anyway. Alright, we are warmed up. Oops, let's get out of here. Day. I actually get a little bit of a. He wasn't breathing for once. Okay, could use a few sticks then. And then we'll get this fire going. Sadly, not a. Uh... It hasn't been sunny for a little while. There's some bunnies. I don't worry, bunnies. I'm not really that bloodthirsty right now. At the very worst, you might be arrow target practice later. Speaking of that, how was our... Yeah, we're about two and a half, and I've never even fired a bow yet. I'm hoping with all the arrow crafting, we can at least be at three before we even do a shot. And at three, you're pretty solid for aiming, I feel. Okay, I'm gonna go get this fire started. I did get a few sticks, right? Oh, yeah, we're good to go. I guess the cardboard matches is fine. Yeah, no way we can fail. And one thing I will point out, there's only uh, two burners on this one. Uh, as they kind of showed this off in the video, so I guess like, yeah, I can't talk about it. Yeah, you only have two cooking spots in this. So let's say one for water and one for one piece of... Uh, so let's like say you've got 30-odd pieces of uh, moose. Depending on your cooking level, that's going to take a while. So you might want to prepare with extra wood just in case. Likewise, the stove in uh, Grandmother's house and out in Pleasant Valley, probably the best bet for if you want to do a mass cooking. I might see a lot more people hanging out there in those spots right now uh, when the update comes. But here, I'm going to start grabbing some meat. I'm going to do a little bit of cooking. Too much stuff to carry. I feel the like cooking is way too easy now when I, when I go back to the old build. This is... Oh, this feels so easy now. Sadly, in a way, I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss this. I'm gonna miss the menu where it's sitting and waiting. 
I know it's weird, but I do. You can see it takes about 10 minutes. For cookie, we'll be a little bit more realistic right uh, with the update. All right, let's get, I'm gonna throw in some coal in just a second. We've got quite a bit to cook today. Okay, got that done. So we have really gigantic food caches set up on about every map we've been to. So now we got a little bit of desolation point, but not a whole lot. Looks like they kind of take semi thorough notes. They have everything we had. Because we're probably not going to, I probably will spend 100 days in the new uh, region. Let's see why not. Unless we really had to am scray. Okay, I'm not sure I can carry yeah, much you, more. You're fine, Mark. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. I don't know who you're talking to, Mark. You're all alone. I'm just a voice in your head. A little bit extra time. I will. I will think around in uh, story mode and see if they did add the changes. But I'm pretty sure they didn't add any changes for that. I'm pretty sure this is just a survival update. But they could be throwing it in. Uh, right. Another blizzard. Not surprising. Let's drink real quick. I would like to get some more water uh, just in case. Pile as much stuff as we can. Life is gonna change soon. Week. I think eventually for the better. I think, uh, I do feel like the Long Dark community is gonna get split in half a little bit. Uh, when the new, that kind of always happens when there's a new big changing update. Uh, some people don't want to change, but you get used to it eventually. I used to hate this, uh, new UI. Now I just, I love it. I don't want to go back. I'm so used to it now. That's fun. I like to get this done if I can. I know there is no changes to ruin meat, etc. That kind of mechanic. The cooking thing is changing. Uh, they could slip that in, though. Uh, what I've seen in the updates could not be everything. They could slip that in the last second. I haven't really tried uh, getting ruined stuff, ruining meat. I haven't taken uh, Mark here into the update. I just didn't want to have any possible chance of some buggery getting in the NR save file, so. I've been hands off on that one. Just been using fresh, fresh survivor dummies for that. Okay, that's another little bit of cooking down. He's cooking, just like just perfect. Mistakes, man. Look at the. World patterns on that, that's just amazing. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. I know. Yeah, 
Yep, keep going cooking for a little bit. Alright, not bad. I know one viewer had said, uh, like, rifle... No, a cooking, you should have cooking level 6 by now. Like, you know, yeah, no extra skill levels coming with this update or anything. But if Mark did have a cooking level, if he could get 6, he would already be maxed out on that. There's a little bit left. There's always just a little bit. Too heavy. Let's just grab the rest of that. So that's about 40 kilograms or so of moose meat. I'd say not bad. Not a bad day. Also, I did another viewer comment. I forgot to address the last episode. I wonder why I didn't light a fire uh, for shooting at the moose. I thought we'd be alright anyway, because I, I, one thing I have noticed is the Moose AI. He tends to get a little confused around Trapper's Homestead. I don't know if anybody else has noticed that. Uh, you see that fight, I shot him like twice, and he's just like, ah, I kind of freaked out. So I kind of just made the plan, run back to safety in case anything happened, but yeah, we would have been a little... The update would have been a little bit of a bummer if I had to sit around waiting for uh, Broken Ribs to heal. I might have had to uh, just kind of hibernate it a little bit. Speed that up. But luckily, it's about half. Alright, it's getting a little bit late. I'd like to get a little bit more water though. Might as well with the blizzard rage or not. the uh, flames coming out of the stove. Look at that, man. That's that's pretty. I wish it wasn't a blizzard right now, but the weather is what the weather is. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Right, so we got a little bit of time left. How much? I'm going to get maybe listen to the five liters. When we get to the next destination, I might just be churning out water like a champ. And that way we won't have, we'll be able to go into the update. Ah, uh, we won't have to worry about anything. I need to uh, drop just travel, something. enjoy. About a five. I'm gonna go get another three, I think. Let's go get three. Might be up a little bit late, but that's okay. We got a little reprieve time. I was like, man, the update's coming this week, but it is uh, coming up next week. Let me tell you, anybody, players that play Long Dark, we're used to waiting. That we are. But I think it is always worth the wait. Boop. All right, we'll let that die out, I think. And we'll drop, I drop at least five. And then I think uh, tomorrow we'll probably get going. Get some nice amount of moose meat. And we'll calorie up as well. I, I don't see why we can't, you know, treat ourselves a little bit. And that way I won't have to carry so much, I guess. I'm going to top that off, though, because otherwise that'll just annoy me. Okay, so let's get a good 10. So 
If there was a roar outside, I don't think you would know. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just check the day. I want to at least say 200 on the journal. I think it should. I don't think the day popped up. But I feel like we are there now. Oh, I would take yep, day we call it day two hundred, day two hundred. So we named the rifle. And there was a lot of great suggestions of names, of course. I did plot through my comments. Not realizing man, I get a lot of comments. Yeah, well, I got I got like nineteen hundred videos. There's a lot of daily comments. I spent a long time uh resp I do respond to every one. Uh yeah, there's something for me to respond to. Uh but yeah, I spent a lot of time in that. So I had to scroll through a lot of it, wrote a lot of that down. But actually, in the end, I decided to go with, uh, kind of came to me, uh, last episode. Right, I'm gonna put you there, because I'm just gonna drop that. Sorry, I'm... Drop that. There we go. Alright, and I thought about what... I yeah, think about Wintermute as well, what to name it. Uh, to look all, of course, all your suggestions. We're actually going to name this, because I, I think this is kind of fitting. We're, we're going to name her Astrid. Of course, from Astrid in the Winter Mute. And Jennifer Hale. Always a big fan of Jennifer Hale. But we're going to be calling this rifle Astrid. I like to switch. I could edit that, so just we call it Astrid. But there you go. Rifle name Astrid. Hope you guys like that name. I like it. Astrid and me, we still got a lot of good days ahead. Hopefully. A lot of good days. But alright, ladies and gentlemen. I think what I'll leave off here. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to get going. And uh, finally get ready for that update. Sorry, I just want to make sure we uh, got all that meat done. Everything with no fuss, no muss with that. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button. It does help out a lot. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.